I recently yeah. partnered with Ableton. Oh yeah, and that's be- and that's because I came from being an an avid consumer and user and got into it so much that I started pushing the limits of Ableton. I made a a, a AI for a AI that used Ableton. You could talk to it; it would talk back and it would do wow. what it asked you to do. And I, and I did that in 2014. Wow. Yeah, so I've just always been into Thanks. into technology like that. And the thing is, I love music because to me, it's 50% creative and 50% science. Mm. You know, it's a lot of math and it's a lot of factual thing. Mm. Y'all remember the game Mousetrap? Yep. Mm -hmm. As a kid, I was a Mousetrap type of kid. I had that game, but I would just turn anything in my room to that. This thing is going to hit off this thing and make this happen. And there's a lot of complex things to make one thing happen. And that's my mindset when it comes to Ableton or, or other dolls or building racks or just building complex systems or making complex things happen with the press of one button by understanding the inner workings of how things are. So to answer your question in a nutshell, it was easy for me to adopt because as creative as I am, I'm also that scientific. So music was the best choice for me. I couldn't be in anything better.